everyone. So I'm in the greenhouse right now, and I just wanted to show you the test that I ran. I put sweet potatoes in a bucket in water in my kitchen, and I grew slips. At the same time, I put sweet potatoes in, three sweet potatoes in the ground, in the dirt, in a pail in the greenhouse. My test is to see which grew better. So let's go find out. Okay, so here we are. I've already taken some slips out of the pail that has the sweet potatoes, but I wanted to show you how I do it. What you do is you grab one of these slips right here and you pull without pulling the potato out of the ground, which is, believe me, tough. It's not easy because the potato wants to keep coming out of the ground. You just got to pull and then look at these. Look at that. Absolutely beautiful. And there it is. Okay. I've taken quite a few slips off the potato and I have one here in from inside the house. Those are the slips from the sweet potatoes that I grew in the dirt in the greenhouse. Beautiful. And here is a slip from inside the house grown with a potato just in water. Which look nicer, those or that one? Those do. So that is the way to do it. Be right back. Okay, so I've taken everything out except that one group of shoots. It's not ready yet. You want them much bigger and much stronger so they can handle outside. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take these shoots and I'm going to plant them outside. Let's go. Okay, so I'm in the garden now. Look at these luscious peas. They look beautiful. And I'm going down, and those are my Kennebec potatoes. And on this side right here is my red potatoes. And these are the bitty shoots that I got from inside the house. You can barely see them. So I'm going to go in and I'm going to plant these sweet potatoes right now. I don't think I could show you because I don't know where I could put the camera. Basically, all you do is just put a little hole and get the all the roots and stuff under the ground. I'll be back. So I got a little bit of a shock. I have nine sweet potato slips from just one but sweet potato that I put in the greenhouse. So that's fantastic. So that is my test. It looks like the better sweet potato slips are the ones that the potato is put in dirt and allowed to grow sweet potato slips in the dirt. Okay, guys, thanks again for watching the Paletta Rosa Homestead, and I hope to see you back again soon. Bye-bye.